Hey there guys, what's going on? Finest fellas here, welcome to a brand new episode of the Warriors of Chaos campaign for Total War Warhammer 2. We're jumping straight into the episode today because we have got some work to do, ladies and gentlemen. Let's start off by getting Prince Sigvald the Mag Friggin Negificent down near Fort Stragov and let's loot this area. Search the ruins, my friend. Oh, I hate these puzzles. I suck so bad at these puzzles. Let's see what we've got going on. Throughout the world, the Old Ones left vast troves of power for use by their most trusted servants. To prevent such power falling into the wrong hands, they placed wards and cryptographic locks over them. As millennia have passed, these wards have weakened, but the arcane locks remain. To access the treasure, solve the puzzle, solitude is always desired. Uh... Okay... I don't get it. Is it one of these that's by itself? Well, this isn't next to any of them. Puzzle failed. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I don't care. I suck at those puzzles. I don't get it. Right, Iber. We need to get you some more troops, mate. What are some of your special skills we can give you? I don't think there is anything too special about them. All right, we'll just stack him up with lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of chosen. I am Slanesh's Scion. Are you indeed? Archaon, the ever chosen, has completed all of his quests. We're gonna have him come down near Prague. In fact, we're gonna fast march him near Prague. How long would it take to get him around here with Kolek? A couple of turns. Uh, there is an army. Of the Empire still hanging around. I'm just going to quickly count with Kolek. I can't see it. Whatever. Alright, I'm sure they'll die to attrition soon enough. Let's get Kolek around here as well. We're going to be fast traveling those two armies to meet up with each other. For now, Prince Sigvald and Iber are going to be together moving south onto Fort Ostrosk. However, I have a feeling there are a lot of armies of the Empire hanging about. So we'll keep them close to each other for now. And end the turn right there. The beverage of today's episode is Coca-Cola Vanilla. Very tasty, nice and cold, just the way I like it. Ah, yeah, tasty. Now, I've had a little conversation, ladies and gentlemen, with one of the viewers over the last couple of episodes in the comment section. Um, I, was, I kept putting the question out there. I was like, guys, what do you want me to see me do next? You know, what do you want me to, to play next as far as Total War is concerned? Or, or anything along that lines, and it was suggested that I play Rome 2. Once again, do an episode on Rome 2. And, you know, I'm I'm quite keen for this. I'm not going to lie, I am very keen to play Rome 2 again. And thank the Lord above that the individual suggested that I play Rome in Rome 2. So that's what I'm going to be doing, guys. Over the next couple of weeks, I'll be hopefully finishing off this campaign, or at least I'm going to try to, in every spare day that I have, and I'm going to be looking over some Rome 2 Roman mods check out for my Roman campaign. That is definitely going to be a thing, it will happen, and hopefully we can get it started by the end of this physical year. But that's just some exciting news coming up on the channel, ladies and gents. Excuse me, it's going to be sweet, I can't wait. Let's fast forward here. Now don't forget that you can also leave suggestions and comments um, saying what kind of Total Wars, or which factions you want me to play. I, I'm totally open to suggestions. However, it's pretty solidified that I am going to be playing Rome in Rome 2 as my next campaign, because I'm kind of looking forward to it now. But if you also, if you want to name generals, if you want to name battalions or entire armies, just post it down in the comment section, and I will be sure to add that into the, the roster here. But yeah, make sure you hit that like button for me, guys. All the love is totally appreciated. You know, show me some love, hit the like button, share it with your friends, let's get a huge community going. I'd love to see some more of you active in the chat. Alright, how many has you got? 16 out of 20. Might as well get him some fast movers as well. You can use one more. We will give you just some more. No, not them. Give you them and... Yeah, that's what we'll do. Because Siggy, over here, 
gonna move you just to this line. We're gonna encamp you. We're gonna get you some more units. Now, Sigvald, if I remember correctly... What was he... Chaos spawn, campaign effect... Oh, it was, um, Marauders for this guy, wasn't it? No. Don't want Marauders for him. No. Okay, these are regiments for now, which are all used. We couldn't recruit Chosen with him yet. Yes, we could. They're over here. Let's go ahead, get four halberds. And I didn't really want to use Manticore, but, eh, whatever. Give him some Manticores, and of course the great weapons that we already took out. And that'll do for him, two turns. Ivor, let's have you scout up a little bit. Fort Ostrosk, what kind of garrison have you got? If we can hit Fort Ostrosk with him, we'd be happy. But I don't know how many legions that the Empire is going to be sending my way. Let's move up with both our armies down here. They should be linking up very soon. Board upgrade available. Alright, let's give you that. And end the turn. Yeah, really, really excited to be back doing this. I, I have a new job, ladies and gents. This is why I haven't actually been recording as much as I have been. Uh, I have a new job, and I'm working away with that four days a week. But uh, do not fear, I'll be recording every spare moment I've got so we can try and get this, this campaign finished off. I know it's dragging on a little bit. But don't be shy. Have a conversation with me in the chat. Let me know any stratagems or any advice that you want to give me because, yeah, I'll make some pretty daft mistakes sometimes in these episodes. For example, we've been all over the Reichlands and we haven't made much of a dent in the Empire. This is supposed to be the end times for crying out loud. So hopefully we can start stomping on the Empire. That's why I raised another army so that we have four stacks and I'm actually thinking about raising a fifth to go down and start stomping on the Empire. What I want to do next is with Archeon, I actually want to get Warriors instead of Chosen. Chaos Warriors instead of Chosen with him. Just because he can recruit them and keep them for a little bit cheaper. Hostile Unit Activity Success. Assault Units. Get out of my face. Bretonia and Artois have garrisoned... Well, they've not garrisoned. They confederated with each other. That is interesting. Polak and Archeon right next to each other. Sigvald is still recruiting. Alright, we can use him this turn. Sigvald, we will use you as a forward operator. Iber, take your forces to Fort Ostrosk. And auto-resolve with you. Yeah, we lost some units, but it's fine. Let's take the... Oh, we only got 113,000. Let's, let's get the Horde growth for him. And, of course, he's got a level up. We're going to make him a very powerful unit, but we also need to get him... Chaos Warriors chosen... Blessed by Chaos. We need to max that out as soon as possible for him. Handsome and lethal. End of turn. There's going to be a lot of end turns in this episode. We need to get some progress done. All right, let's see what they all do. I know the Empire is just going to start sending endless stacks up north to try and deal with me. Whenever I'm not recording on YouTube, I am also streaming on my other YouTube channel, Finest Plays. I'll have that down in the comment section below if you want to go and check that out. I usually stream Call of Duty there, or I'm playing Skyrim over on my Twitch channel, Finest Fellas. I'll have that down in the comment section below. Uh, sorry, down in the description below. Both of them will be down in the description below, guys. I'm not making any sense today, am I? Both my alternate YouTube channel where I stream and my Twitch channel where I stream different games will be down in the description of this video. So you can check me out live. You can have a live conversation with me. We can talk jokes and we can, we can hang out a little bit. Oh my goodness, English is not coming easily to me today. This episode, I am... Again, practicing with different recording methods, and I'm doing my best to try and try and experiment to get slightly better quality from my videos. I, I have noticed that the graphics haven't necessarily been the best, so we're working on it. We're getting there. Every episode we make progress, and that's just what's going to have to be is episodic progress. Now, they are raising a stack over in Prague. But we should be able to deal with it before it comes too much of an issue. 
Jarl Spearbreaker. That's a good name, Spearbreaker. Alright. Keeps assaulting my units. I wish you'd stop. Are you a god? I am. Alright, who do we want to do this with? We want to do it with Kolek. He still needs to level up a bit. Um, Balance of power is not in my favor. Why is that? We've got still a lot of Chaos Warriors. We could just swap the Chosen with these. Alright, continue Siege. And we'll bring in Archeon as well. And then we'll Assault. And then it's pretty much guaranteed. There's no point in fighting this, because we'll win. 316 losses. We'll take the money. And we killed Kurt Von Corden. We also gained the Ogre Blade. I'm pretty sure we had that already. Alright, Archeon, we need to do some warrior switching here. So, Chaos Warriors. Give me all the warriors. And you can have all the chosen. Archeon, the ever chosen. It's still a 20 stack, and he's got all the warriors now. I think that's made things a little bit more expensive. As far as buildings are concerned. Alright, we've got five population surplus. Spending 9,000 a turn. Alright, Archeon, once he levels up next, we'll need to give him the Abyss Forged Armor. So we get the minus upkeep on Chaos Warriors there. Yeah, that's what we're going to have to do. Are you a god? I am a god. What can we do with you? Not much at the moment. And Archeon's just swapped over some units, so they're busy. What? Siggy and Iber are going to head south. No, they're not. They're going to head west. Okay, let's go west. You dare. You dare. Never Let's go this way. Let's split them up. It might be a bit of a mistake, but we'll split them up. We do have a stack here. Led by Wolfram Hertwig, Boris Van Strahl, and Curtis Van Priestoff. We've got a witch hunter, an empire captain, and a general of the empire with a fairly decent force. They've got great swords, halberds, the swords of Ulrich, the... Gundermans, Surefires, they've got some rifles, Reichsguard, Empire Knights, they've got Outriders with grenade launchers, Regiments of Renown, they're the Bordermen, they've also got the Emperor's Wrath, Suitsen's Guns, a Hellblaster, so they got some firepower in this in this one. I'm pretty sure we could take them with Siggy, or Prince Sigvald, I'm just going to call him Siggy, <laughs> I'm sorry, Prince Sigvald E, I'm pretty sure we could take him there. With these two armies, Kolek and Archeon, we're going to start coming down this way like Kislev, Porchakova, Bekvan, Zavastra, Kappelberg, Wolf. But yeah, we're just going to start decimating through the Empire here. End the turn. Let's see what happens. Hmm. So yeah, if you hear me slurping away on some soda, that's just me drinking my Coca-Cola. All right, let's see. I know the Empire, as soon as they start losing a few settlements, will start responding in force against my armies. But I do have some of my... Let like Bersonling's camp, some of my allies. Let's just call them allies. What are they? I... Marauders! There we go. I can barely speak English today. My Marauder units will be heading south with me on my glorious Dark Crusade against the Empire forces. My goal for this campaign is to bring the end times to mankind. Not necessarily to dwarves or to elves or all the other races, but to men. I will grant myself a victory once I have brought the end times to man. With all the creatures of the dark, the vampires, beast men, the rats and all the rest of them, I'll be trying to ally with them as much as possible. Ready for duty, Rail is back! The Sword of Cain has been claimed! That's fine. That's fine. Iber! Go forth, my son. Bring darkness. Darkness! Take the money. Alright. We have raised another settlement. Let's give you Blessed by Chaos. And then we'll need to start reducing the upkeep for some of his units. Now... I'm going to keep Siggy fairly close to him so that we can assist him. 
Kolek. Let's bring you down near Kislev. But still an ability to encamp. We could upgrade his thing here. Yeah. I also want to recruit some units if I can with him. Can we get Shagoths yet? Dragon Ogres. We cannot get Shagoths yet. Shame. I kind of want to get him some more monsters. I don't want to have to keep recruiting infantry. I'd li like to get him some monsters. Are there any other monsters? We can get spawn. We'll take two turns to bring those in. Spawn. That'd be interesting. See, I'd like to use Forsaken, but they're not as good as I thought they'd be. Uh, Just recruit out of his pool for now. Let's get him some aspiring champions. I like those guys. Alright, Archeon, the ever chosen. Come down here next to Kolek. In a reinforcement range, if possible. Hero not moved. Rel, come down here to Archeon. Well, Archeon has a full force right now. Uh. Thing. We give you two. Iber could use somebody in his army. He could use a hero. No. See if we can actually have you taking out some of their heroes. Yeah. Can we do anything here? Assault garrison. Yeah, that'd be interesting. Come down here and see if you can do that for me. Failure. That's annoying. We've got him more as a champion than anything. So let's get him better at doing some of this. Assault units, assault garrison, uh, specialists, assault units. Public order. Training. Get him to do... Oh, garrison. Get him better doing some of that now. And end the turn, once again. Easy peasy chaos squeezy. Alright. Fast forward, let's go. I'm kind of getting back into the tabletop Warhammer. I'm going to be buying up some miniatures and painting those up. It's I'm really looking forward to it. Some Warhammer 40k, though. I didn't really get into the whole Age of Sigmar or fantasy thing for tabletop, unfortunately. I don't mind playing it in Total War. Uh, like, Total War Warhammer. You know, but I, I just can't get into it for tabletop. I'm sure I'll paint up some models at some time now. I found the model for Deathclaw and Carl Friends. Oh, man. Absolutely magnificent model. Oh, Chaos Corruption and Vampiric Corruption around Kislev. More Vampiric than Chaos at the moment. Chaos Corruption is going up, though. Yeah, you can see all that taint around Kislev. They've got a full stack there now. Assault Unit Success. Get off. Was the target of successful hero actions. Oh no. So he has gained the trait unlucky. Let's have our man come back around and see if we can assassinate him. Only got a 35% chance of a positive outcome. It was a failure. Worth a try though. Alright, Kolek has ranked up. Let's see if we can give you... Something... We need upkeep to be cheaper. Recruitment cost, income, holdout time. Alright, let's get blessed by Chaos in here for his Chosen. Let's make his Chosen stronger. Archeon, you have a Chosen. I want you to start sieging Kislev. Let's get some towers going. Invade! Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Let's get you down here next to Kislev and encamp yourself. No buildings to upgrade with you. That's fine. Bretonia is on the move. That's interesting. Paulson, our 
or a wizard. We could reduce his uh, miscast chance. Yeah, I want to do that. I don't want him to miscast. Let's have Sigvald over here. Uh, I'm not overly confident that they could destroy Bretonia here. I don't want to go too far out of my way. Castle von Rocken, who took that? But we can't let the Empire start going through their lands either. Don't want to overstretch, because we've only got two armies here, and they've got to kind of come down this way. Bring ruin. Bring ruin. All right, Iber go this way. And then Sigvald right behind. And we'll have you guys defend each other. Dark Prince. Let's have you both in camp. Upgrade you if you can. Alright, we're going to have to start getting some income. We're down to 93,000. Losing 8,000 a turn. So we're going to need to start being a little bit more aggressive. End the turn there. Let's see what the enemy can do to us. Empire makes their move. Alright, so he got another uh, assault unit success. That's annoying. Alright. End your turn. Let's go. Alright, some of our nations are moving out now. I'm curious why they're not actually occupying some of this ground. Technology research. Inscribed Chaos Armor. Plus 5 melee defense for Chaos Warriors, Inspiring Champions, and Chaos Knight units. We also gain the trait Solitary. 3 plus campaign movement range for Iber. Let's see if we can assault. Now, it still says we don't have a good chance with all these units. I beg to differ. They have a lot of ranged units. They do have a lot of halberds. I'll give them that. But we... Okay. Oh, because it's not Kolek that's initiating this fight. So we actually have to have some towers. Okay. Archeon, if you... Break Siege... Are you still in range to attack that, though? If we were to attack you here... Yeah, we can assault straight away. Let's just go. Let's go in, because we need the money. And we will have our battle of the episode. Like I said, I'll do my best to bring at least one battle per episode. And this will be a good test for my recording as well. All these chosen, all these chaos warriors, beasts, monsters, champions alike, mustered by chaos to bring once again death destruction to the empire can't wait let's do it empire's got a lot of uh lot of state troops here ready to defend forest Todbringer at the start all right start deployment let's have kolak attack from this direction where does it say our allies are coming from here so we'll have kolak and his lot I'm gonna deploy here and attack this gate so all the monsters along with kolak are gonna charge the gates the Chosen are going to charge there. Rambo Mortals! Great weapons here. Along with the Halberds. What does that mean? Does that mean they can do ladders? Excellent. Inspiring Champions. Alright, and start the battle. Olek. Charge. Monsters. Charge. You lot. Up you get. Halberds next. Great weapons. Inspiring champions. Alright, that's that entire army moving out. We are taking some serious firepower from their artillery, but fear not. Reinforcements are indeed on the way. Eye of the gods. Let's get Kolek himself to charge down here, along with his two regiments of renown. Got his knights and his chaos warriors. 
Halberds can come down the middle. His knights can stay put for now. Make sure that we utilize everyone. Or chosen on the right flank of this assault are taking damage. Along with Kolek has taken some damage as well. That's all their gunners getting their shots out. As soon as we break through the gate and get men up on the walls, we can silence those guns. That gate is not going to last long. That means Kolek and his monsters, as soon as they charge through, will be able to just utterly wipe out these men. I'm going to go straight for the general. Imagine seeing these. Oh no. They have broken through. Everyone charge. Yeah. You're all dead. Alright. Might get a little bit choppy when we're looking in there. Alright. All the knights are getting targeted. So let's, let's hide them. Hide the knights. Taking serious casualties on this point here. The knight's taking some casualties, so we're going to move them out to the flank. Hellstorm rocket battery gets some shots in. Archeon's doing some damage to the gate. Oh no. Some of these chosen are getting annihilated. They are getting torn apart. Those guns are good. We've got men on the walls now. We're gonna start hacking away at the Empire troops. We've got our monsters in here. Come on, lads. In you go. If you can take out that Empire captain, I'd appreciate it. Lanesh's perverse glory. Silence those guns if you can. Some of our units are extremely depleted. They're spoiling. Yes, those are words. On the ladders, boys. Let's go. As soon as we get up and over, we'll be fine. All the dragon ogres. Bring the dragon ogres up this way. Yeah, it's going to get really choppy once we start looking in here. A lot of units down there. Our Dragon Ogres charge their Empire Knights. Empire Knights should not be holding up to my men. We are putting an end to some of their missile troops up here. As soon as my men get on the walls, it's, it's pretty much over. Hey, Ars Wario. Up you get. Have you broken down the gate yet? Yeah, almost. Alright, you lot. I know it's going to be a suicide charge, but charge their halberdiers. Their handgunners should not be surviving this. Charge, monsters! That is just chaos down there. Kolek is running around, giving it to the captain. Go on, son. Bring him down. I am enraged! Alright, let's bring uh, the knights around for a charge. You lot kill them. Uh, you lot come down here and start taking on some of their knights. Archeon, have you broken through yet? You have! Dinch's many glories! Go! Archeon. Activate the Slayer of Kings. Oh, they have a tank. That's interesting. Where are my knights? All my infantry up here have decimated the enemy. The Empire is on the run on all flanks. Alright, 
Alright, knights are on the way. Cole like Sun Eater. Let's see if we can start taking down some of their artillery pieces. Archaeon, are you taking out the Witch Hunter? I actually want you to crack open that tank for me, please. Cascading Fire Cloak on yourself. Archeon will pop that tank open pretty quickly. I hope. There we go. We are taking casualties, but it's fine. Slay every mortal. Uh, let's have the Dragon Ogres charge. Charge these artillery pieces. Bring down their cannons. Point blank shots coming in from the Hellstorm. All the Dragon Ogres are arriving. Oh, it's too late. <laughs> the cannons could not charge. Sorry, the cannons could not fire. The crew is under attack. All these little manlings are getting carved up for dinner. Taking some firepower here. These knights are doing an excellent job at holding me back. Come on, man. Finish him off. How is Archeon doing against that tank? Tank is almost dead. Archeon doing excellent damage here. Mankind. Fading. I have enraged. That is it for the Empire, ladies and gentlemen. The Empire has been defeated. I want to see this tank go. From the perspective of Archeon. Bring it down. Pop. Oh, damn. Knocked down my warriors. I don't think we lost many there, but we won. We destroyed them. Got these Griffites trying to run away. They won't get far. They run for their lives. The Empire troops here is caught in a sea of chaos. Not good for Empire today. We will burn this city in the name of the Chaos Gods. End the battle there. You are victorious. Fantastic. We lost, um... Good 400, 460 men. The enemy lost a good 2,000. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, good work. The Dragon Ogres, of course, performing very well. Colette get about 91 kills himself. The Halberdiers getting 100 kills almost apiece. The Chaos Warriors, uh, sorry, the Chosen with great weapons doing very well. Aspiring Champions not getting much done, but I have a feeling I didn't micro them as well as I should have. And a lot of the a lot of the Chaos Warriors are actually pulling their weight for the top here. 134 kills, 106. Very good. Their generals did very poorly, but they were all targeting Colek, so and Archeon didn't do very well. A lot of their troops didn't do well. Actually, the most of the damage from the enemy came from their artillery and their demigriffs. Infantry just didn't do much at all, to be honest. And that, let's take the money. The Helm of Discord. We've killed Humphrey Hitzler, Helmet Leetdorf, Waldemir Pappenheimer. Kislev has been destroyed once again. And it's about that time in the episode, ladies and gentlemen, to bring it to an end. Once again, thank you for all you guys who are following this series, making it possible for me to do these episodes by showing your support. It means the world to me that you are enjoying my, my series of the Chaos Warriors Let's Play on Total War Warhammer 2. Show your support even more by continuing to hit that thumbs up button for me if you're enjoying the content. But if you're not, give me that heads up below by hitting the, that thumbs down. Till next time, bye for now.